be making basics. What's going on YouTube? Beat Making Basics back again with another dope video. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe because we're coming back to back with bangers. Today's video, I'm gonna be going over the latest update for Logic Pro 10 dropping just a few days, okay? This is Logic Pro 10, actually not even Logic Pro 10, it's gonna be Logic Pro 11. So check it out, man. Um, in the coming days, they're gonna drop um, the latest Logic Pro version okay this is gonna be crazy they're gonna be including a whole lot of AI features so we got session session players stem splitter uh, chroma glow which uh, you know what I'm saying it's gonna make it even smarter than ever that's what they said here so let's just take a look at this apparently in California Apple unveiled the all new Logic Pro for iPad 2 and the Logic Pro for Mac 11. Now, this is gonna be the, the, the catcher here. Hopefully we don't all have to upgrade, okay? All have to upgrade again all of our computers, all right? But they're saying that they're delivering breakthrough professional experiences for songwriting, beat making, producing, and mixing, okay? All powered by artificial intelligence. The new Logic Pro introduces incredible studio assistant features that augment the music making process and provide artists help right when they need it now i'm kind of excited about this whole aspect of the session players so basically it'll create some loops and stuff like that is what i'm guessing so let's just keep on going here these features include session players which will expand the popular drummer capabilities in logic pro 10 or actually not Logic Pro 10, it's Logic Pro at this point because we're going to 11. They're gonna include a new bass player and keyboard player. Okay, so we got a drummer, a bass player, and a keyboard player. Man, what more do we need? We don't even need to hire anybody anymore. You feel me? Just go to Logic Pro. Stem splitter to extract and work with individual parts of a single audio recording. So that's gonna be dope. Think about it like this, y'all. Instead of having to go to a third party app or third party um, program online to be able to take your samples and maybe extract certain things out of it. Say there's a horn part in a sample. You feel me? This stem player is supposed to be able to take that horn part out. You feel me? So this is gonna be dope, okay? And then Chroma Glow to instantly add warmth to tracks. Uh, this is gonna obviously be some type of new warm uh, reverb. I'm guessing it's gonna be kind of similar to um, the Hollow Room or something like that, but we're gonna check it out, man. It's, it's scheduled to drop on Monday, May 13th. So y'all, fingers crossed here. I'm not gonna have to upgrade my whole computer. All right, now y'all will not have to do that on May 13th, but Lord willing, we're gonna have some bangers coming next week on this new software. That's gonna change the game for me, especially these session players. This is pretty dope. Um, offers groundbreaking experiences for creators providing a personal AI-driven backing band that responds directly to feedback. Mm. Drummer took the music creation industry by storm when it debuted as one of the world's first generative musicians more than a decade ago. So really, AI has been here, you know what I'm saying, for a while. We just haven't made, you know, been, you know, acknowledging it like, you know, we are now. But they're basically gonna be getting even better um, in addition to the virtual bass player and keyboard player. So I'm hoping that this is gonna basically be a setup where you can come in here, put the key and everything. Um, I'm guessing that's probably when it's gonna be. You could probably come over here and it looks like you can do the complexity. It's gonna be kind of similar to the drummer, but I'm guessing with piano and, and bass as well. So this is gonna be dope. This bass player was trained in collaboration with today's best bass players using advanced AI and sampling techniques or technologies. The users can choose from eight different bass players and guide their performance with controls for complexity and intensity. While leveraging advanced parameters for slides, mutes, dead notes, etc., etc., the bass player can jam along with chord progressions, or users can choose from 100 bass player loops. This is crazy. With chord track, users can define and edit the chord progressions to a song, and the virtual bass player will follow along perfectly. Wow. 
So then the keyboard player, I guess it could do some of the same stuff here. Okay. This looks pretty nice. And I know we're gonna have a whole lot of fun with this, y'all. Coming on over here to the stem, you can you know recover great recordings. Most musicians perform their best without the pressure pressure of a formal studio session. These moments are often found in voice memos recordings, an old demo cassette tape, or are captured from a live show. Listening back, these recordings can reveal magical performances that are nearly impossible to recreate, making them lost to time. Now, with Stem Splitter, an artist can recover moments of inspiration from any audio file and separate nearly any mixed audio recording into four distinctive parts, drums, bass, vocals, and other instruments, right on the device. With these tracks separated, it's easy to apply effects, new parts, or change the mix. Powered by AI and M-Series, Apple Silicon Stem Splitter is lightning fast. Can't wait. Dialing the perfect tone. So, uh, model sounds produced by a blend of the world's power, most rendered studio hardware by leveraging AI. Okay, let's see. Okay, so this is more like a saturation plugin. I'm sorry, I said it was like more like a reverb. It's not a reverb, it's a saturation plugin. Um, add some saturation naturally. But this is exciting, y'all. Um, <clears throat> if you already have uh, Logic Pro 10, this is gonna be an amazing update, you know what I'm saying? And you can get it for free if you already have it, you know what I'm saying? And that's that's one thing that's pretty dope about them. They They've been pretty consistent with like if you once you purchase Logic, you don't have to keep on purchasing it over and over and over and over again. So thank y'all Logic and then y'all let me know in the comment section if y'all are excited about this. Excited, excuse me, excited about this. I am. I think it's gonna be dope to kind of mess around with the um, with the with the session players and he, really all of this stuff is gonna be dope. The stem splitter. Come on, bro. This is like a saturation plug. We might not necessarily need this as much, but I'm sure it's gonna add some spice to it. And then when you think about adding this on top of everything that's already going on in Logic, I'm talking about all of the other advancements, all of the things that they got all the way up to Logic 10.8, plus this unstoppable program, man. Again, let me know in the comment section below what y'all think about this. Y'all excited about this? Y'all ready for this drop? Y'all wanted me to drop some more videos, man. Next week's gonna be, about to be nothing but bangers, okay? So, y'all get get stay tuned for this, man. Make sure y'all stay uh, stay tuned. Put your post notifications on, man. We're gonna be dropping videos back to back on this brand new um, update. I'm excited about it. I'm glad it couldn't have came at a better uh, time, actually. So. Y'all ready to create, man. This, this is going to be nice. This is going to be nice, man. Make sure you head over to my website as well. Buy courses, kits, and everything like that. BeatmakingBasis.com. Just click in the links uh, below or, you know, just type it in. But anyway, man, I'm out. Appreciate y'all watching. I'll see you in the next video.